welcome fans, parents, family members, and alumni to our senior night. Senior night is our time to recognize our senior basketball players. And before we begin on our night, our seniors would like to recognize our visiting team seniors tonight first. I want to ask our president of our Booster Club, Ms. Laura Isaacson, to assist me. Uh, Seward Seahawks, when we call out your name, would you please step forward? Mr. Nick Pano. Mr. Hunter Kratz. Mr. Sully Hawes. Mr. Michael Wilkes. Mr. Rhett Sieverts. Mr. Kajel Nilsson. Mr. Jonah DeBoer. Now for your Grace Grizzly seniors, Tyler Ellis, Bobby Gallimorn, Jackson Goforth, Gregor Lindstrom, Brogan Nieder, and Noah Schamberger, and Caleb Wood, please stand. They must balance schoolwork, church, practice, long nights and early mornings, as well as the responsibilities of being an ambassador for Grace Christian School. It is our prayer that these young men, whom we honor here tonight, will pleasurably look back and reflect on their high school careers. The good times and the bad times as they prepare to graduate in just a few short months. After this year, these athletes will never again wear the maroon and gold representing Grace Christian School. The uniforms they wear do not merely soak up sweat and show the wear of years of play, but as with those who wore these numbers before them, they will forever evoke memories of these young men, their smiles, disappointments, and achievements. Even splinters of their character will be embodied in these woven symbols of Grace Christian School athletes. So tonight, we celebrate these individuals and their parents and say thank you for being a Grace Christian Grizzly. Our first senior I'd like to recognize tonight is Mr. Tyler Ellis. With Tyler, please step forward. And I would ask his parents to join him in the front court. Tyler is a son of Troy and Lori Ellis. Tyler has been at Grace Christian School for 13 years. He enjoyed wrestling briefly before a snowboarding injury that required hip surgery. Tyler has won a creative writing award his sophomore year, enjoys volunteering at his church, and has coached kids for basketball camps. Tyler would like to join the military. His favorite verse is 1 Corinthians 13, verses 4 to 7. Love is patient and kind. Love does not envy or boast. It is not arrogant or rude. It does not insist on his own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice at wrongdoing but rejoices with the truth. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, and endures all things. Thank you, Troy, Lori, and Tyler, for your investment and commitment to Grace Christian School. And may God continue to bless you in your future endeavors. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Tyler Ellis. Our second senior tonight is Mr. Bobby Gallahorn. Bobby, would you step forward? Bobby's parents are unable to be here tonight, but we are his family, so I ask his teammates to step forward. <laughs> Bobby Gallhorn is, is the son of Marvin Gallhorn and Amanda Fox. Bobby has been at Grace Christian School for four years. During his high school years at Grace Christian School, Bobby has played basketball and ran on a cross-country running team. 
This year is one of the managers of the team and would like to attend Alaska Christian Colleges so down in Alaska. His very verse is 1 Thessalonians 5 verse 11. Therefore, encourage one another and build one another up, just as you are doing. Thank you, Margaret, Amanda, and Bobby, for your investment and commitment to Grace Christian School. May God continue to bless you in your future endeavors. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Bobby Galvin. Our third senior tonight, Mr. Jackson Goforth. If Jackson's parents were joining in the foot court, Jackson Goforth is the son of Greg and Julie Goforth. Jackson has been at Grace Christian School for three years. He has participated in basketball for two years and is one of the team managers this year. Jackson has been on a ninth grade honor roll, took second place in a non-fiction creative writing contest this freshman year, as well as second place in a fiction writing contest in his junior year. In, in addition to being an athlete, Jackson has in the lives of others by being an active member of the Georgia Mrs. Trip his 11th grade year and currently mentoring a group of junior high students at Change Point. Jackson is undecided which college he will be attending in the fall, but is planning to pursue a degree in youth ministry. His favorite verses is Philippians 4, 6, and 7. Do not be anxious about anything, but everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving. Let your requests be known to God, and the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Jesus. Thank you, Greg, Julie, Jackson, and family for your investment and commitment to this Christian school. And may God continue. The best in the future endeavors. Ladies and gentlemen, Jackson, go for it. And our fourth senior this evening is Gregor Lindstrom. The Gregor's parents joining him on the court. Gregor Lindstrom is the son of Scott and Karen Lindstrom. Gregor has attended Grace Christian School for five years. He has participated in cross country running, cross country skiing, track and field. And this is his second year managing the varsity basketball team at Grace Christian School. Grace, Gregor is also a national merit finalist. In addition to being an athlete and achieving his academic goals, Gregor has invested in the lives of others by serving on the GCS Alaska Missions team for two years and is currently preparing for his third trip in April. Gregor is awaiting to hear back from the colleges he has applied for before making a final decision as to which college he will attend. He plans to major in computer science. It's very fair verse is Psalm 73, verse 7. We don't have that verse here. But thank you, Scott and Karen and Gregor and family for your investment and commitment to Grace Christian School. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Gregor Lindstrom. Our fifth senior this evening, Mr. Brogan Nieder. Brogan's parents was stepped down on the court. Brogan Nieder is the son of Brady and Stacy Nieder. He has attended Grace Christian School for 13 years. He has participated in band and cross country running. Brogan has played basketball all four years at GCS. He competed in state tournament with the basketball team during his sophomore and junior year, as well as being a team captain his senior year. He has also been a competitive member of the track and field team. He's competing at the state meet in four events his sophomore year, his junior year, and hopes to do the same this year. He was selected to compete in the Brian Young All-Star Track Meet as a sophomore and junior, and hopes to do the same this year. In addition to these athletic achievements, Broga is also a Grace Christian record holder in the triple jump. Broga plans to attend a full university in the lower 48, but is undecided at this time as to where he's going. His favorite verse is Deuteronomy 31, 6. Be strong and courageous. Do not fear or be in the dread of them, for it is the Lord your God who goes with you. He will not leave you nor forsake you. Thank you, Brady, Stacy, and Brogan, and family for your investment and commitment to Grace Christian School. And may God continue to bless you in future endeavors. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Brogan here. Our sixth senior this evening, Mr. Noah Schamberger. And Noah's parents and family, please join them in the court. Noah Schamberger is the son of Mike and Carrie Schamberger. Noah has been at Grace Christian School for 13 years. He has been a committed athlete on the basketball team for four years at Grace, as well as the soccer team. Noah was MVP for the Club Classic his freshman year, and the MVP for the All-Tournament team this year for the Grace Classic. Noah is undecided which college he will be attending in the fall, but is planning to pursue a degree in computer science and wants to be a youth pastor. His favorite verse is Ephesians 6, verse 11. 
Put on the whole armor of God that you may be able to stand against the schemes of the, of the devil. Thank you, Mike, Kerry, Noah, and family for your best commitment to Grace Christian School. May God continue to bless you in your future endeavors. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Noah Schamberger. And our last senior for this evening, Mr. Caleb Wood. We're going to ask Caleb's parents to step down on the court. Caleb Wood is the son of Jeff and Lynette Wood. He has been at Grace Christian School since he was in kindergarten. Caleb is on the National Honor Society as a competitive athlete in cross country running, basketball, and soccer at Grace. He has received the Scholar Athlete Award and has been a captain of the varsity soccer team as well as the most valuable defender on the varsity soccer team. In addition to being an athlete and achieving his academic goals, Caleb has invested in the lives of others by being an active member of the Georgia Missions teams and the Guatemala Missions team. Caleb is still deciding which college he will be attending. It will either be Whitworth University or Point Loma. He plans to enter a pre-dental program and then going on to dental school to become a dentist. His favorite verse is Joshua 1 verse 9. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Thank you, Jeff, Lynette, and Caleb, and family for your best friend commitment to Grace Christian School. And may God continue to bless you in your future endeavors. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Caleb Wood. I present you the class of 2017 Boys Grizzly basketball senior team.